I think there should be a picture on the stream. I don't, yep, there's a picture, right. So the first thing we're checking is time to main menu. Because... 20 seconds in. Yeah, to be fair, it might load faster on the second run. Maybe that's the trick. <laughs> but it seems to be just sort of... So anyway, guys, welcome to the stream. We're checking out Star Citizen 3.1x. Um, we did recently a stream to check out the last version. So they've done a load of work on the game and we're going to check out the new version. And every time they bring it out, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to time the dis... The t I'll call it, mate, when we make the main menu, but you should be no. able to see the stream now. Um, yeah, but there'll be a delay, so... Yeah, yeah, so cool. I'll call it. And then what we're going to do is we're going to load up the game. Oh, wait for it. Black screen with a green box. Oh, no, it's a different loading screen, mate. <laughs> still counts as the same one. Yeah, it's still... It's just changed. Oh, go stop. So how long did it take to get to the main menu? Uh, Well, it says here 112 seconds. 112 no. seconds. That I don't really know how this counter's working. Don't, There's don't, no points or anything. So it's just 112 seconds, okay? That's less than two minutes. That's fine. All right, reset the clock. We're going to go into Universe, and we're going to try and load Crusader. Okay, are you ready? Yep. Yeah. Let me know when. Okay, go. I really hope that this thing doesn't take too long. You never know. I mean, it's, sometimes it goes in fast and sometimes it takes forever. Mm -hmm. I think I think maybe just quitting the game and then running it again <laughs> might actually help you, which is funny. Not loud, mate. It's not loud. Because the backstory on this game is there was once a Kickstarter. And on that Kickstarter, there were on in that month there were two sci-fi flight games, Space Sims. Um, one of them was called Elite Dangerous, and we all know how that ended up. And the other one was called Star Citizen. So, yeah, here we are. It's 2018. I think this Kickstarter might even have been like before 2015. I don't remember if it was 20, was it early 2014 or I think it was. I don't remember. Don't know. I don't know. But the point is, yeah, let's see what the state of play is. Um, for just so you know, I've turned the graphics down to low and like turned all the effects off. I think I even went down to 720p. So it might look not like they show it in their promotional videos, but it's probably more like what you're going to get. It's funny because it looks 1080p in the stream. Oh, well, this is just a loading screen, so... Do, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, uh, the, screen, the, the stream is 1080p, yeah, but basically the game will end up being upscaled because of this. But it, 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 it'll probably look better than it does on my well, end. Well, we're 150 seconds in so far. Oh, boy. We Taking re longer. We really don't... If we hit the 500 second mark, that's... Sorry, 300 seconds is 5 minutes, 600 seconds is 10. Oh, hang on. Something's happening. The audio cut out. Usually when the audio cuts out, it means that it's... <laughs> crashing out trying to load something in the background, so... <laughs> this is on an SSD as well, right? Yeah, it's on an SSD. I've got uh, 16 gigs of RAM, I think, minimum. I might have more than that. I can't. I honestly can't remember off the top of my head. I've got an i7 processor, a good one that's so less than a, I think it's less than a year old. Do you have the 7700? Yeah. And, no, no, you have the 6700. Sorry, yeah, 6700 actually. So it's it's not the best processor, but it's by no means a crappy one. It's in the top. It's in the top top third. Um, and then the uh, graphics card. Because we were doing um, we were doing VR dev for a little while, never actually made a project that was released. But um, so we had yeah, the specs. Yeah, because the hardware keeps changing. Yeah, because the hardware keeps changing, basically. You know. Um, but yeah, like I say, so we've got a good a good 10 series Nvidia card in here. I think I got might have the 1070. 
You do, mate. You have the same as Yeah, me. I got 1070. So, it's not a shit system. In fact, I would argue most gamers don't have this spec, because I'm developing on this computer. So, you know, I shouldn't have had to turn everything down. And for ref- and to be fair, 2.8, the 2.8 was was all on high quality and it was running at 30 frames locked no problem mate you know there was no lag it yeah, loaded yeah. quickly everything worked and then suddenly between 2.8 and 3.0 the performance just went to crap well you're at 360 seconds no 400 seconds Four, so we've gone over five minutes see this is you know what i'm thinking that's minutes that's four minutes huh what are you not re well look if it goes up to 60. If it goes yeah it over, did it went up to 60 and then turned started to again okay so so it's definitely minutes and so then it's seconds minutes then. it's minutes then okay fine. Yeah. so so the first one was uh like a minute and a half then that's fine you had, had one minute 20 yeah yeah 120 for the first menu was fine i mean i would accept five minutes for a game that ran really well and looked really good I'd accept 10 minutes. I'll go off and make a cup of tea, come back, no problem. All right. Um, but with well, this kind of loading... on an SSD, you know? Yeah, but this is, this is on an SSD. And it still takes this long. Because you're supposed to buy one of these brand new Intel 800 pound super fast SSDs. But to me, <laughs> to me, that's like putting training wheels on a bike and saying... Yeah, you, you, it won't fall over, mate. It's the best bike ever. It won't fall five over. Five minute mark, five minutes, ten. All right. Yeah. Like, and there's an argument as well that if you turn all of the graphics down, actually, you get worse performance because the graphics card wants to be set to high quality, yeah? So I'll put it on high quality as well. And we'll have a little look. Because to be fair, it's unplayable. I'm sorry. It's, well, it was in the last patch. We're going to find out. I mean, I really want this game to be nice. I've even bought it for friends. So it's not like I'm just shitting on this game because I don't like it. Yeah? Yeah, I tried the game out and I've got the same specs and I was just like, yeah, mate, why is this? Yeah, like, so if you... So that's the thing, right? Say you want to play with your friends. So you buy a starter pledge with a ship for your friend, like I did with Dom, who's with us here. And, uh, and then they play it out. Well, they didn't buy it. You know, they're not really invested. They're not going to give, you know, they're not going to go, oh, well, I, I, I spent this money, so it's I got to make the most of it. They're going to go, well, you gifted it to me and it runs like garbage. Okay. You, like, you don't get fanboys, a fanboy um, opinion from someone who didn't actually even buy the game, right? They're just playing yeah. it. You get an impartial judgment. And the, and the thing is, I can't, you know, I want to believe, I want this game to be good. I do, even though it's had a troubled history before it's the even come is, out. It's always had a performance issue history, you know. Yeah. Which is why I stayed away from it. Yeah. Well, to me, the reason I stayed away from it, even though I had it for so long, because I didn't touch it until two point six. I think. I think I might have done a video on it like years ago, like when they first brought out the hangar module. Like, check out there. Seven minutes. Um, and then when they brought out the Port Olisar, I think I came and checked that out. Um, and then, like I say, 2.6, I played it a lot. I flew around and did all the little missions. was really impressed with how you could just get in and out of the ship and do little zero-G missions. That was cool. As You know, that was really yeah. cool. Yeah. You played 2.8 and you said, yeah, it runs right now. Yeah. It. Yeah, it runs. It was 60 like, frames. Then you brought me it. And they were like, let's try 3.0, oh, or what the hell? I know, what the hell happened? It was like a freight train just collided with the performance of this game. And like, they didn't even, all they added was planets. And the joke is, you're nowhere near a planet that you can land on when you start the game up. So it's like, where's, where did the performance go? You know, you're only loading Apparently stuff. they increased it from like 24 players to 100. Yeah, but there weren't 100 people online. Do you know what I mean? There's, yeah. You can look and you can see and it's like there's only like six people here. It's pretty dead most of the time. So it's like, obviously they've got multiple instances going on, I bet. Right? Mm -hmm. 
Um, and I had a great time in 2.8. I went on that ship that's landing on that landing pad in the middle of the you screen. You can't even go back because it's an online game. Hey. No, you can't. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can't even like downgrade it and have to have a good game to play. I mean, I just hope they fix it. Because the thing is, like I say, we tried out one of the bigger bigger ships, not the one in the bottom right, but the big ship in the center of the screen right now, landing on this on that pad. Um, we got one of those, got in one of those with like three, four people, and we were all flying about, manning the guns, fighting off people. You know, going to bases and sh oh, it, was, it was really fun. It was amazing, and I was like, "Man, this is great!" And we recruited, so we recu recruited a couple people, Nine started minutes. up an org. You know, everyone piled on, and they're like, "Yeah, let's try this out." So we started flying about, and then the new patch came, and it was like, "This is a different game, mate. This is weird. It all looks the same, but you can't even walk in a straight line in pilot when you're in pilot mode." You know, when you're walking, it's like... Eh, 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 eh. Alright. Yeah, so anyway, here we go. Oh, hang on. Something's happened. Yep, get ready, mate. Get ready. We're not I'm quite there. Ready. We're not that I can... I, hear, I can hear the sound effects to say I'm getting out of bed. Or I'm in bed. Oh, right. okay, wait. Okay, go. Stop there. Nine minutes, 40 seconds. So, ten minutes to load the game. All right, guys, I'm in bed. On an SSD. On an and SSD. a fairly fast computer. Yeah, so let's... Because you're not going to get anything much faster because no. of GPU prices. Exactly. Unless you buy, like, the £1,000 hard drive that they made in conjunction with the Star Citizen devs at Intel. <laughs> What's it called? An Optimax SSD. I something. don't know. It's ridiculous, mate. Anyways, so press H. And now you can see what happens. I've pressed it. It looks laggy, mate. I've pressed H. It didn't accept my input. Spamming a button. Come on! Can I not get out of the... F wow! I can tell this is going to be... Come on. Press H. H? Isn't... What? Keyboard's fine, mate. Mate, I can't get out of bed. This is amazing. This has not happened before. So 10 minutes to load and I'm stuck in bed. Who had the <laughs> idea of making you be in bed that you can't get out of? I can't do anything. H. And the thing is, it's not H. your network lag because H. you have 200 up and down. Yeah, I've got 200 meg internet as well. Yeah, but come on. Is there like a trick to this? Do you have to get the right exact frame? I mean, just look at the pulse in the bottom left-hand corner if you want to get an idea of what's going on. You can see it stops and starts and stops and starts. And the, sh the game's shaking about like space engineers in the middle of a big clang. And I'm supposed to be just lying in bed right now? I'm yeah, this is the H. same effect you get in space engineers. Yeah, when, when you clang. clang has just begun. Oh, wait. Suddenly it went black screen. Did you see that? No. Okay, we're getting no. up. We're getting up. We're, I, I don't know how. Now I saw it. Huh. You got smoother performance now, slightly. Um, well, yeah, by turning every- Mate, look at this gun! What the hell? Oh my god! I've never seen it so bad. Right, I'm gonna do a look left, look right test. Do you remember Halo? Do you remember when you <laughs> had to look left, look right, and up, down? So left. Like every FPS after that. Right. To the center. And up. Now I'm going to go down. Oh my days. To the center, please. Can we look up? Wow. Okay, so F4 will show us in uh, third person mode. Okay. Yeah, now we're gonna... improved. Mate, they emailed me saying they've improved the performance from 3.0. Yeah, I know. I got the email too. So I'm pressing F and I'm pushing the door. It's not doing anything. Well, this seems worse than 3.0. And I've turned everything down, okay? this It used to run in Ultra. Every, all the effects on at, at 30, 30 frames. At least. What? And you can hear the music cutting in and out. Come on. Oh, my God. Right. Can we... 
This is just ridiculous. I'm trying to get out of my stupid little... Can we get rid of this house thing? Imagine imagine if you invested like thousands of pounds on ships oh. in this game. Oh, wait. Hoping for a finished product. Wait, look. It's the, the mouse isn't turning into the icon to open the door. Look, you can't use the button. Hang on, I'm... Okay, we're going to move the mouse. Just trying to spam because there's nothing. Are you kidding me? Right, I'm going to go back. And we're going to walk up to it again. Man, this is such a nightmare. Going to go back again. What is going on with this door? Okay, I'm literally... T I'm close. Mate, how do Wait, well, oh, hang on. There was, it did something then. There, got it. Oh, no, no. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. I got a glitch. There it is. Go, 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 go. Oh, Jesus. All right, level one complete. <laughs> Mate, I should get an achievement that the for that. tutorial pop, uh, level, Tom. Do you know what? I think all of the preloading is finally finished. Because if I run down this hallway... Wow, it almost looks... Wow, look! I almost made it to the end of the corridor without juttering. Alright, so just for the sake of argument, guys. Oh god, it's really having trouble, right? Basically, I, for the sake of argument, I'm going to put it back to 1080. If it can handle that. Oh, it can't, but I'm going to just show you what happens. I mean, otherwise... you going into the graphics options, you know, if it can handle oh, that. Oh, I know. Actually, that we did have some issues. So, we've got it on low right now. Let's put it on high, okay? I'm not going to I'm not gonna put it on very high because it's just not going to work. All right. Yes. Now, should I keep V-Sync? I've also turned sharpening and chromatic aberration down, so that's normally at 100. All right, that'll do. I think that's everything. Oh, and I turn motion blur off. That's on by default. Camera and object. Oh, yes. Right. So it looks pretty, right? It's pretty. Yeah. All right, so uh, should we go down and find a ship then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what? For some reason, it's not lagging anymore. I'll take it. Okay, <laughs> I'll take it, mate. But do you have to, like, stand in the station for a good half hour to let everything pre- That was definitely about 15 to 16 minutes. Yeah, of just preloading, mate. That's what it was. Hey, look, On an SSD, here. I feel sorry for the hard drive user. Right? See, look, it's all... Actually, look. Okay, let's run then. Ah! Okay, maybe not run then. Yeah, when this I run... This is why they walk in all their demos. This is why, this is why they walk in all their demos. Ready? Holy shit, what was that? <laughs> Something just blew up, mate, and the game just went... Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, don't don't run, because strange things happen, okay? Oh, yeah, if, <laughs> if you're wondering why I've only got the chest armor on... Okay, I've only got chest armor on, my dude. The reason for that is that um, one of my Kickstarter rewards was the orc armor. Okay? But when I loaded up this version of the game, I don't have any of my stuff. I've got nothing, right? And you get 5,000 credits to start with. So I went into the armory to buy the orc suit. Yeah? Mm. But when I spent the money, it only gave me the chest, because you have to buy the arms, the legs, the chest, and the helmet separately for 2,000 yeah. each. So you need 6,000 credits to get the stuff I already own, but you only start with four. Apparently, it's easy to earn money, though, so... Yeah. That 5,000 credits just meant to give you some basic equipment, I guess. Well, you get you get a chest plate, mate. Good GG. GG. Yeah, yeah, you get chest armor. Okay, so... Ship revival, retrieval. Okay, I've got my Reliant. But I can't retrieve it. What? Why can't I retrieve my ship? 
Okay, let's claim it then. What? It wants me to spend money to get my uh, ship? I've got to wait six more minutes to get my ship? I have, I've just, waiting, huh? I just, dude, I just loaded up the game for the first time. I haven't played it. What the hell? All right, fine. We'll, uh, we'll file a claim. <laughs> and then what does that mean? It pay expedited fee. One minute. So that's, so uh, you pay money and you still have to wait a minute. Okay, fine. Maybe it's like a respawn timer, but it seems a little excessive when you haven't actually played the game that day. Like, it's not like I got blown up the last time or anything. Okay, so we'll leave this menu. Uh, right, let's just show you the armor. I think it's over here. Is that it? It's actually running pretty well now, to be honest, compared to what it was running earlier. Oh my god. Mate, earlier was a nightmare. Can, but it's still janky. Yeah, I, and look at the door. Door, you got door issues. This door's supposedly open. Look. This is a trader. Garrity Defense. C can we come in, please? No, you're not allowed. Do we have to, <laughs> do we have to trigger it? Hi, thanks for coming in. He, the guy's talking to me like I'm in the room. <laughs> I'm not in the room, mate. Do we have to do the trick? Oh, oh, close. Close the door. Let's close the door. Oh, fuck. Do you know what? Right, is there another door? No, that's the only door. Okay, right, well, screw it. Maybe, maybe that place is closed. <laughs> I have no idea, mate. Okay, so we've got guns. Hi, I'd like a gun, please. Hi, welcome. What's this? I find it funny how the weapon store door opened just fine. Yeah, I know, right? Just works. So what's this? A custodian SMG. What's this? A gallant energy rifle. Okay, let's buy one. No, we're not inspect. Really recommend that one. Yeah, I'm sure. Let's just. Arrgh. What are you doing? Yes, confirm purchase. You have the guns. Got to nice check. choice. Um, okay. Now we go press F1. We got a lot of variety. Take your time and have a look. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. So we click on my armor. Click on my weapons. So I've got a ballistics SMG, allegedly. So, where's the weapon I just bought? Yeah, sorry, we're gonna hide that behind menu after menu. We just got a few new items in, what? so make sure to check them out. Weapon, ballistic pistol or energy pistol. Uh, wait, I've got to like carry different. So, so yeah, the thing I just bought isn't actually in my inventory. So straight away, nice. I'm like, what, what, what did I just pay for? <laughs> um. We just got a few new items in. So if I go sure to armor, them. look, you can see the core thing. So it sold me the armor, but it only sold me the core. And then it actually sold me a different undersuit, which I didn't even buy. So I've got a complete undersuit when I... Anyway, yeah. Uh, okay, so why is my helmet red? I, I got some new inventory in. Definitely worth taking a look. Yeah, why... What the... <laughs> Why is my helmet red? Screw it, I can't be bothered to figure this out. Wait, it's not red anymore. Oh, is it just the highlighting that sometimes works? Got some new inventory in. Definitely Anyway, worth whatever. Look. Safe changes and equip. Wait, what? Oh, God, I just. It's, I don't even know, mate. Right, so. If I go to. Let's go to somewhere cool. I think if I go out to Comaray 275. Got some new inventory in. 
definitely worth taking a look. Set destination. It won't let me. Come array. Set, it won't let me do that yet, so I gotta do it in the ship, I guess. Because you're 100% triggered. I'm 100% triggered. Can you actually. You can't. We just got a few new items no. in. No. Make sure to check them out. Right. I'm not even gonna bother with the armor. Hopefully that time is done and my ship is available now. Yeah, Your please. ship available? Don't be silly. Retrieve. Your ship has been delivered to the following landing pad. All right. So. I'd laugh so much. Whoa! What the? What's? What are you doing, buddy? Right, okay, now, I can't actually see the pips, so I don't know which pad my ship is on. Where am I supposed to go? I've just got to figure it out, I guess. Yeah. Whoa, it's lagging again. Ah. Um, I think I'm going to be on pad eight. Oh, God. I, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I might have to turn this blurring off in a minute. It's going to give me a headache. Like, it wouldn't be so bad, it's just it's stop-start, and, uh... Right, so normally... Oh, no, not this again. The airlock cycling. Level two! Get in the airlock! Oh, wait, it worked, it worked. Okay. Press. Oh, my God, the airlock works! I'm not ready for this. I don't even know where my ship is. I'm just guessing it's up on pad 8, because that's where it usually spawns, but... <clears throat> oh, thank God for that. It is here. Alright, so... What the... Whoa, whoa, just... Uh... Mag? There we go. It's a lovely ship. How do you turn on the torch? Hold on. Light? No. I'm sure there's a torch button, but I don't know what it is. So let's close the door. We're getting in the ship now, mate. Oh my god. Allegedly. How's that possible? <coughs> I don't know, mate. Mind your head. Okay, so. Uh oh, there's some guy floating above that pad. Could it be another player? No. Okay, so we're in the ship. Um, someone's zooming around. Okay, so let's turn the ship on. I do like all this stuff. It is pretty cool to actually do all this. But... Uh, Engine. Flight ready, please. Hello. How can MISC help you today? Systems on. I like all these gauges and stoof. It's cool. So we can suppress... We can suppress IR. There's like a form of stealth in the game where you like restrict everything. Um... We've got shields over here. I hope there's hotkeys for all this stuff, because it looks like a nightmare to manage in combat, but... Eh, uh, what do I know? Everything's changed. So. What do I know about knowing stir? Right, so let's go into the external and lift off. And quick. Oh, there's no engines yet. I swear I turned my engines on. Maybe I just turned everything engine on. Yeah. Hold X to boost, left shift to afterburner. 
Oh no, we are taking off. It's very laggy though. Come on. It's frozen in fact. Hang on. It froze when I pressed spacebar to take off. I never free. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Look. Ah, there we go. It, it felt like I loaded a different game there. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Let's just go all the way up, mate. I'm not even going to bother turning. Last time it went into a rolling spree, so I'm going to get far away from the sh from this station. Okay. Press N. That's my landing gear up. Oh no, the pixels are wrong. Look, the pixel effects. What the? Not the, part... the pixels. No, look, the particle systems haven't moved for my um for my for my positioning thrusters. Yeah. You can see them firing in space on either side of my ship when I pitch and roll and stuff. Yeah. Hang on, let me see if I can like fix that. Breaking the immersion. Right, and also my engines are firing. There we go. Well, no, it didn't really work, but whatever. Okay, let's um, slow down, turn around. Where's the station at? There it is. Right. Okay, so we made it to space. We're still in the no-fly zone. And there is some bugs, but it's cool. That's what they call it, an alpha. Right. F1. Ah, oh, they fixed this too! This menu was at a weird angle last time I, when I was in the ship trying to do it. It wasn't like straight to the camera. Okay, so... Angles! Oh! oh. Right. Camera. Oh, free game on Steam! Free demo available now. So, so we got to go to this comma ray and probably get blown up and have to run. Okay. Whoa, why did it just come up again? Whoa. Quit the thing. Quit the menu. No, I'm stuck in the menu. Yes. No. Come on, close. No. <laughs> no. I can't get the menu to go away. Ah, uh, what do I do? I mean, wait, oh no, it, uh, accept? No, nothing, nothing's working now. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? It made a funny noise. Hello? What's happened? I got a black screen now. You are dead. No, I don't know. Music stopped. Black screen. Disconnection. Well, you what, mate? Wait, really? <laughs> it just disconnected me randomly in space. Right, for the sake of... Ex right, this, we're doing this for you guys that are watching right now, okay? I'm going to load it again. Have Can you got that? Yeah, please. Have you got the timer? Hold on. Give me a sec. Sure. 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 I saw sheep on the sea, sure. <laughs> Which one is the time? This one. Tell me set. when you're ready. I'm ready. Okay, and go. Maybe it loads quicker on the second run. I mean, you'd think there's temporary files or something. I don't know. Nah, mate. Mate, I was just about to do a hyper jump. It was getting good. God damn it. Do you know what it's going to do now? It's going to say that I've lost my ship because it's like out there. I'd laugh if it's just out there, mate. Yeah, and it spawns you back in space station, yeah? Yeah. I mean, it would be nice if it spawned me in my ship, but I think this is going to be a bit of wishful thinking, mate. I reckon I'm going to wake up in bed in about 10 minutes time and have to pay money to get my ship back. Even though my ship's fine, it's just... Jesus. And like I say, none of this was an issue. None of it. 
And I don't know, it kind of made me look like a twat because like, you know, I'm trying to go, hey guys, let's go and play this game. And people are like, it plays like garbage. And I'm like, no, it doesn't. Come on, let's go play it. And then to be fair, um, I tried landing on a planet in the last version and I did land on the planet, but I couldn't actually find any structures because the all of the pips went missing. There's another video on that. Right. So I basically got down to the planet, was like, wow. Um, and I think I actually tried to land the ship and it was a horrible mess and exploded like har like really badly or something, I can't remember. Because like I say, oh, oh dear. Like I say, you know, um, the game does look good when it's running. And I have played with people and it's been a really cool experience. Like, we did this whole thing where we explored this Starfarer, which is one of the bigger ship... Well, it's not actually, it's only medium-sized now, but... <coughs> it was really cool. Um... It's just hard to see that this will be a thing. It's not a thing. Well, it's gonna, you know, I mean, seriously. <sighs> Mate, paper citizen. <laughs> no loading screens. Let's just develop it, it'll take us five months. It we'll wouldn't... have it out before this game's released, yeah? The graphics won't be shit, though. I mean, the graphics will be shit, sorry, by comparison. Be... Oh, yeah. But has anyone actually done a sprite-based space game, the way you can land on planets and stuff? No clue. I don't think it's ever been done. I might be wrong. Somebody correct me in the comments if you uh, bothered to watch this video this long. I mean, it's basically a video about Star Citizen with very little Star Citizen gameplay because right now the gameplay is getting out of your bed and loading a ship. I just, all I wanted to do for this stream was get to a planet and see a structure on that planet. That's all. Yeah? Mm. My, my goal is to get to a planet and see a structure on the planet. You'd think that would be Super simple. Like, I could load up Elite Dangerous right now, not having played it for six months. I could take any one of my ships, fly to any planet in the game, of which there are millions, and go land on a structure. Yeah, okay, fine. All the structures come from a set group of, you know, they all look kind of the same-ish, right? There's a lot of copy-pasta going on, but it runs. Yeah, I can't get out of my ship but I can get in a buggy and drive around, you know? It's not like I'm always in the ship. And like I say, this this game has got a lot of stuff going for it. But I need 30 frames. I mean, really, I want 60. Five minutes. Oh, man. I'm just sort of basically trying to keep the stream going. Because, like... It's just a loading screen, man. <laughs> but yeah, like, I wanted to start a little org and uh, get some bods on, fly some big ships, you know. Do stuff we can't. Hmm. And the joke is, right, if you don't have that armor, uh, some of the pilot suits don't have jetpacks, mate. So that means you get out of your ship in zero G and... You float to your death. Well, no, you're just stuck there, mate. Like an inch away from the ship. You know? Well, that's good. It's 
my fault for not equipping my armor. Oh wait, I have to buy it again. Oh wait, I don't have enough money. So that's one of the reasons I bought the core, because I thought the core might have the jetpack in it. I don't know. I don't know. And I'll be honest, the only reason I got the game was I liked the foldy ship. It looks a bit like it looks a bit like an old World War Two plane, but then it goes vertical, and I'm like, ah, oh, that's cool. And you know what the worst thing about it is? You're always clipping the bit that sticks out, you know? Right. Because, uh, you know, you'll just catch it. Say you've like flying towards something in a dogfight. Oh no! It just crashed. Really? What time did it crash at? Six minutes fifty-seven. Wow. So it spent seven minutes just to crash in the loading screen. Reset the timer. Mate. <laughs> Reset the timer. Okay, we're going to see again. Mate, I'm doing this one more time, okay? This, and then we're not going to touch this until the next patch, basically. Because, damn. Damn, dude. I'm just going to check the chatty. No, no one said anything. That's fine. So... Yeah. Yes. Okay, so Star Citizen is not responding. I don't know if it's worth trying. Is it third time's the charm, all right? Third Let me know time. when. Okay. Black screen. There's a reaction channel for you. Reacting to trying to load games. <laughs> That's, That's amazing. Oh. That's amazing. <laughs> Start the timer. The splash screen oh, is here. Even though technically, you, I, I, I don't even know when it started. I mean, uh, I'm currently transmitting, by the way, two meg per second. I don't know why. Huh. Yeah, I'm doing two mega second right now on the on the bandwidth. Your guess is as good as mine, mate. Like, what does it need two meg per second for? I haven't loaded the game yet. Like, is the menu some kind of multiplayer instance? Yes. How did you know? I guess it is. So, two meg peak, what are we doing? Loading the menu, guys. If you just tuned in, we are testing Star Citizen performance. <laughs> it almost feels inappropriate to call it that. <coughs> so, the splash screen just went full screen. And that is my only update. <laughs> there is no oh, bollocks it's like trying to keep the stream trying to keep this going when there's nothing you're trying happening. mate it's the, but there's it's nothing the hardest thing in the world right just I want to believe did you know Star Citizen's a real game I want no to believe way. there's an unidentified flying game here a UFG People say it's a conspiracy. Oh, okay. The next, the okay, the loading game, loading game screen has appeared. Okay, I got a good feeling about this, guys. I've got a. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one, yeah. This is the one. We're gonna. This is the one yes. where we're gonna. We're gonna finally see what the game has to give us. Oh. Second star to the left and on till morning. Oh. Oh. Loading. Loading. Hang! 
That's what it should have on the screen right now. <clears throat> oh! Awesome sci-fi soundtrack has started playing. But the actual loading screen is frozen. I got nothing. Well, we're at three minutes twenty. Really, mate? Yeah. This is just for the main menu. <laughs> Aha! Whoa! We're, we're, get ready. No, it's a, just another loading screen. <laughs> loading screen three. Well, stop, stop. There it is. There it is. Oh wait. Go to last instance recovery. Press bracket to join oh mate i think it might give me my old ship back all right nice even though it crashed last time so how does that work wait three, have i just three minutes 40. okay start the timer again it's loading the game even though i've never seen that recovery thing before okay i've never seen that before Okay, so what if it recovers me to a game crash? Because that's technically what happened last time. <laughs> it didn't give me the option to recover when I was actually out in space in my ship. That that was no. Uh, okay, well whatever, yeah. Let's just uh, let's just go with it. I can't see the bandwidth monitor in game anymore, so I don't know how much streaming is going on. Wouldn't that be funny though? It turns out that they stream a lot of the game as well, so it's like, it's like. <laughs> a lot of the... a lot of strain on their servers. Oh yeah, well, yeah. But it's Amazon servers. They can <laughs> take it, right? Well, I don't know that. I don't know where the game's hosted. All right. I don't know where the game's hosted, guys. Okay, the music is like when the music starts like clipping and stuff. I I guess the game's nearly there, but it could just be some giant bits of data. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just trying to make the stream or video that you're watching interesting, because but I would say the bulk of this video has been this frame. You know, it's like half the video is just loading. Loading! Oh man, we're gonna get to see what it's like to load in 1080 because, of course, I've got the full graphics on now. Hell uh, yeah! Science! But we didn't actually just change one thing, we changed loads of things, so it's not really a good experiment. Whatever! We went on low graphics and everything turned off. Then we got on high graphics, everything turned on. Oh man, do you reckon I'll be able to get out of the chair out of the chair this time? Oh, no. I can't wait. Level one. Get out of the bed. Oh, I can't wait, mate. Oh yes, I will not be denied. Here we go. Getting ready. Bling bling. Tell stop me the, stop the timer. Two minutes sixteen. So it took it was quicker. Yeah. Alright. And I press H. And it's just letting me out. It's uh, horribly choppy, but it's happening. All right. Okay, I'm gonna try and open the door. Level one, complete. On to level two. Whoa, what the? What the hell was that noise? Nothing actually happened. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell? Okay. Door, please. Run, 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 run! Get out the door, get out the door, get out the door! Uh, why am I shuffling? What the hell is this walking speed? Look how feeble I am. Uh, uh, what's going on? <laughs> I, I dare not run, guys, okay? Well, it didn't recover you to your ship then. No, it didn't recover me to my ship. 
That's so lame. I do have my rifle though, so at least it remembered my inventory. Ah, oh, can you, are you, right, just so you know guys, the stream is not lagging. Do not adjust your TV set. If I just keep walking like this, I think eventually it'll preload everything and it'll stop being retarded. And when I say that, I, it's got no reference to mental health. It's like, it's like a retarded ignition, you know? Like when you burn stuff and you have a retarded flame, it just means it's not really burning very well. That's what I mean. It's a very appropriate word right now. Okay, come on. Like, we're not, we're not burning with an optimum flame here. Oh, God, come to door. I feel like I'm having to walk through jelly. No, this guy knows what's up. Welcome to the oh. Fort Oligar ship deck. Please press the screen to continue. Okay. See you later, dude. There was an NPC, Dom. <sighs> okay, I'm, I'm slowly shuffling. Uh, <coughs> I'm shuffling towards the computer console. Okay, we're here. Use. Oh, look. Retrieve is not an option. So what about, what about track? My mouse is all over the place right now. Track? So... I just don't even know what that does, okay. Claim, fine, claim. Oh. Six minutes. I've got 1,000 credits. File a claim, 59 credits. At least it's not 1,000 credits anymore. Okay, one minute. Got to wait a minute. Ah, get away from the menu. Ah. I wonder if the armor place will work this time. Look at that movement. Oh man, that's amazing. Okay. Ah, come on, mate. You can do it. Ah. Ah. I'm gonna try running. Why are you running? Oh my god, this guy's trying to run. Oh, where'd he go? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Alright, this should be Garrity Defense. Let's go. Ah! <laughs> Come on. Come on. No! <laughs> it just closed in my face. Can I walk through it though? No. Go, 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 go! Oh my god. Hi, welcome to the store. <laughs> yeah, alright mate, you rip off merchant. I can't believe this guy. Look. So, when you press F on this, it's not doing anything. Press F. Mark Orc X Core 2000, yeah? Legs, or oh, arms, 2,000. And I can't even select the legs. Leg. Legs. No, you're not allowed the legs. <laughs> How much is the helmet? Uh, put your mouse on it. Helmet. How can I select the helmet? Look, it only lets me select the freaking core. This used to work better, you know. Oh! 1700 for a helmet. It did. Everything was fine, mate. There was nothing wrong with it. Everything worked perfectly. It looked like... In fact, you know what? At the longer I don't do anything, the better the performance of the game gets. So maybe the trick is you're supposed to just log in and leave it alone. Look, even this guy's walking around now perfectly. Wow, I've actually got frames now, Dom. Oh, nah. Why did he just turn around? <laughs> I'm going to follow this guy and see what he does. 
while I'm waiting for my ship. Where's he going? Where are you going, bud? <laughs> what are you doing, bud? This is like Skyrim glitching, mate. Look, he's moonwalking the top stairs. I'm just going to go up this escalator. It's not going down. Hmm. Well, there you go, guys. Are you seeing the stream right now, Dom? Hey. You gotta see this. <laughs> oh, and he's he's finally got up the stairs. Hang on, I'm gonna follow him for Amazing a bit. Amazing NPCs, yeah. Wait, let me see where he's going. Where are you going, mate? Why are you running? He's not running. Where is he going? He's going to landing pad 10. Mate, you've got no you got no suit on, bud. Oh wow, what's he doing? He's gonna just look at stuff. <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? That's, that's actually pretty pretty plus. Yeah. Makes sense. Okay, my ship should be here now. Look, see, this is what it used to run like from the get-go. Right. Retrieve. Because I remember I die and Your I. Your ship has been delivered to the following landing pad. Oh. Uh, can we. Why can't I get away from this menu, though? Uh oh. Oh, there we go. Landing pad 7. Right. So, yeah, I used to respawn and I'd, I'd run and there'd be a guy waiting for me on the pad. So, you know, you wouldn't want to keep him waiting. And I remember I used to Kept basically. waiting, huh? Yeah, I'd sprint all the way there, mate. And. It would be fine. It would just be like playing any other game. It's just running nice and smooth. Okay. Pads five to nine. See, like this. Like it's running now. It's really suspicious. Because um, it makes you wonder what changed. What the hell? Five to eight. Here we go. Right. So. And I miss my armor and stoof. But it's cool. I can get it back. Right, so we say, say, press. See, I would like do do missions and stuff, but I just want to know that I can actually get to the planet right now, because it's pretty pointless if you can't do that. Right, here we go. See, look, it's running perfectly now. It's glassy, mate. There's very little problems going on. I want to see if this one thing still works, because I worked out a glitch. <laughs> Which would actually get me in my ship quicker. Hang on. It still works! Or does it? No, doesn't work anymore. Oh well. It was worth trying. Oh god, what have I done? So anyway, this is my ship. Doesn't look like much, but it was just supposed to be like a little scouting thing. And there's uh, enough room for two players. Even though I have had three players in it. That was funny. Yeah, we just we just shoved him in the cockpit and he stood on our heads. <laughs> okay. Close the door. See, when I'm, if I wanted to, like, turn left, turn right, it's nice and quick. It's not, like, taking the mick. And I've got all the effects on now, so I'm quite happy with this, actually, because I thought I'd have to run it in low performance forever. Turns out you just have to sit there for, like, ten minutes and do nothing. More like half hour to get to this point. Well, that is true. So, uh, flight ready, please. And... Hello. Engine on today. and take Systems off. On. Right. Let's fly. Landing gear up. Why am I afterburners shooting down? Something's not right there. So we've got some particle systems that are not aligning right. Uh-oh, there's players out here. They'll probably shoot me up. Whoa, I just basically flew sideways 
and pulled loads of G's. Whoops. Anyway, so F1. Let's go somewhere. I want to go to the planet. Of course. Of course. So we've got. Of course. We got Selin, Yella, and Daymar. I've only ever been to Daymar, so let's go to Daymar. I want to actually land on it. That'd be great. There's, there's a moon, another moon. There's loads of moons everywhere. Right, Daymar, set destination. Open the Ark star map with F2. 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 That's what I already did. Okay, so there's a quick way of doing that now by just pressing F2. Good stuff. So where's my destination at? I've got to, like, look around and find it. Oh, is that it? That's it. All right, let's go to jump. So hold B. Oh, one time I did a stream and the warp drive didn't work and I was just raging. Uh. Yeah. Press T to lock onto nearest hostile or R to lock onto a target. Okay. We're quantum traveling, Dom. Brakes. I'm allegedly too close to the Bottom planet. Whoa. And there's a cooldown now? What's that? I don't even know what that means. Okay, so if I press R, it should target what's in front of me. Okay, well it says there there's an emergency ridge shelter thing. So if I press F2, zoom in. Dunlow Ridge Emergency Shelter. There it is. Click on it. Set as destination. Okay. Right. So now what? I guess we just fly this way, huh? Alright. Seems a little excessive, but... Can we not, like, go faster than this ever? No. No. <laughs> okay. Boost and everything. Let's go as fast as we possibly can. And the speed caps out at... What? 1,151. Okay. No, 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 no. Don't slow down. Don't slow down. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, crap. Wrong button. There we go. Right. If I just let go, it'll just keep going at this speed now. So if I hold F and just check out what's going on up here. Can you actually look at the menu, though? That'd be great. So, so apparently I'm just drifting along. I'm generating no IR or EM at this point. Uh, I'm going at max speed. What else? Proceed. Contact received. Contact with what? Uh-oh. Oh, what did you do? Ah! Holy crap, that was, um, that was, that was like, I think I nearly killed myself then. Oh no. I was in, I was looking at the stuff, right? And when I came out of it, the control for the joystick took over. So it made the ship pull up. You know what I mean? And so then I'm like... Going sideways at maximum. What the hell? I can't even see. There we go. There I can see my speed. My idea is to go directly over Dunlow Ridge and then go down to the planet. That's my idea. I don't know if it's going to work. It's almost a shame. Ah! What the? See, look. I just want to look at the menu. I just want to look at the menu and it's uh, dicking me around. So basically, don't bother. Just sit here and let it drift. For the next 500 seconds. Oof. Yes. Oof. <coughs> so here we are, guys. Space engineers. I mean, star citizen. <laughs> Landing on planets. I bet when I get there, it'll turn out that Dunlow Ridge Emergency Shelter is like the most uninteresting shelter on thing on the whole planet. Like I just picked yeah. the worst place to go. 
but whatever, we'll see. Okay, so yeah, we're just cruising along. Okay, so yeah, for the next 300 seconds, I are mostly driving in a straight line. Mostly. Yeah. Okay, I gotta watch out for satellites, apparently. See, that comma rays thing was really cool, right? Basically, they have these stations and um, it's like a comma ray, you know, and basically inside it there's a, a, a panel and you can hack it to be either pirate or good guy, bad guys or good guys, right? So if you're a pirate and you kill players around there, you can keep the beacon off, right? Or hacked for them. And then if you're a good guy, you have to fly in, kill the pirates and then EVA inside the station and hack it to the, to back to the good guy faction. You know what I mean? And it was actually, that was like a really cool little thing because they had all these different points everywhere and players would get up, they'd fly out and they'd go and, you know, <laughs> screw with each other, basically. <coughs> and it was like a big space-based capture the point exercise. And that worked really well. Um... I, I haven't I haven't bothered with any of that since because I just sort of took it as red and I wanted to see the new stuff you know so apparently we've got 362 kilometers to go it feels like it's on the other side of the planet as well just from, likely is. just from the way it's moving like you would think there'd be a quicker way to get around the planet and over you know, because otherwise that means that there's going to be certain bases that are so far away from the dropout point. <coughs> Unless, of course, you have to fly somewhere else and then come back and you land at a different spot, you know. Because of the approach and everything. I don't know how accurate it is when it comes to that. Uh, I might also be missing something major, like maybe there's like a different mode for your engines to get qu I, but I, I can't find it if there is one leave it in the comments guys they won't though <laughs> <laughs> don't forget to buy my free game for some reason the IR is spiking all over the place I don't know why is it because I'm being chased I don't know is there a, is there a, a radar Right, press F. Let's try looking around at this stuff again. So... <laughs> Turn the engine off. <laughs> My heat is constant. See, there used to be a list of players up here, but there's nothing. So I'm guessing that, nope, there's no list of players because there's no one here. And we've got this whole stealth thing, but I don't think I need that either. There's me on the map flying along. So I guess this is like some kind of shield thing. Like shield balancing, I guess. And then, what's this going to be? Weapons versus thrusters versus whatever that means. Agility, I guess, like maneuvering thrusters. Oh, wow, look at that. You have to get below this point to be in stealth. So I guess you can, like, nerf it somehow. I'd really like to have a bit more of a play with all this stuff. But uh, I'll wait until I've landed. Obstructed. See, there is a station around the back of the planet. Dunlow Ridge is now 
on the horizon of that planet. So let's put my mouse here so I don't kill myself again. Ah. There we go. We're gonna have to move. Just a little bit. Please don't shit your bricks. Oh, why is it lagging? Don't lag. I don't like it when it lags. It usually means game over. I don't like that. I don't I like. <laughs> I don't like lag. Okay, so we're now going really slow. 220. So I guess this is cruise speed. So okay, we need to boost because otherwise we're not gonna we're never gonna get there. Okay, up we go. Oof. Contact received. Contact received, it says. Contact with what? There's nothing on the contacts menu. You troll! Trying to make me red out, mate. 160 kilometers, and I am traveling at like over a thousand, so in theory. Are you there yet? Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? Oh, oh, no. Oh, 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 are we there yet? No. Oh, 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 o
Maybe you should lower your wings, yeah? That's my landing gear, right. Landing gear down. Hmm. This isn't good. Put out them wings! Oh, you did. I did, I put the wings out and it stabilised. There's also a giant square below me. No. I don't know why there's a giant square below me. And I don't know where my menu, my HUD's gone as well. Oh wait, the HUD's back. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, so where's the thing I was trying to get to? That's my question. Look, Dom. Sand and bones. As far as the eyes can see. Right? So after that rolling fest, I've lost my bearings. Ah, there it is. Wait, what's that? An OM3. Is that the guy that wanted a lift to Pirate City? Yeah. <laughs> That's not good. Okay, so... Yeah, it's probably like an ambush mission. Yeah. Okay, so let's go over there then. Uh, flight mode, please. Please don't jerk out. I do not know what... I think... I think when I hit the boundary that made it planet, and not space, my ship just went into an uncontrollable roll. <laughs> no idea, mate. But we'll be there soon. It doesn't look like there's any kind of settlement here though, mate. Unless I'm like really high up and don't realise it. No, you're lower than you think. Yeah, I'm slowing down, dude. Okay, there's something down there. It's probably like a tiny building. Oh god, it's lagging like loads. It says it's 300 meters down, but it really doesn't feel 300 meters away. Why did my landing gear deploy? I didn't... Landing gear down. Wait. How? Mate, is that just... Oh god, the... <laughs> it looked like a box. <laughs> right, screw it. I'm just gonna come down a bit. We can take it in in this mode. Okay, well anyway, landing gear. Am I about to land on that thing? No. Good. Are we not... are we landed? We're not landed, mate. Wait, what? Yes, finally. Right, we're down. Okay, um... F. F. Oh god, not this again. <laughs> yeah, the ship's still flying. It's not locked to the ground for some reason. Landing gear is deployed, but not working. Mate, what's it doing? Get off the ground! <laughs> ah! What are you doing, ship? What are you doing? I pressed right and it went left at full speed. <laughs> this thing is a death trap. Stop! Okay. I'll tell you now, I had a much easier time landing my ship. Right, hang on. Land, oh, please. Where? Land. Is that landed? Come on, man. That's got to be it. Right. F. Engine off. Power off. Uh, open exterior. Now how do I get out of this chair? Exit, there we go. Oh. <laughs> it's an absolute bastard. But I got it. I did it! I'm on the goddamn planet! <laughs> yeah, and apparently had a notification saying you got on low fuel. Low fuel? Oh great, so I'm stuck here forever. Yeah. Oh well, whatever. I've got a place to live. Beyond I can Jakku. Just... Got live on Jakku. Now. I'll be a space nomad and just let this thing gather dust. <laughs> right, so hang on. So we got... We have... 
the arc light energy pistol with only 30 energy bricks, which you do have to hold capacitor. You're gonna okay. have to find the uh, spear. And we have. Stop. And then go hunting the. Stop. The energy. The energy SMG that sounds like pit, like a gun. Okay. Do we have a knife? We can melee them with the gun, though. Can we do that? We, can we do a cool pistol whip? Yeah. I was sure, I'm surprised there's no melee. Okay, stop, stop shuffling along, you lazy bugger. All right, we're at Crusader. Or oh, it's made by Crusader, I don't know. <laughs> okay. We're going in. Wait, what? Did you... He just dropped his gun instead of... No. That's not how we breach and clear, my friends. <laughs> okay, let's... Uh... What the hell? Now I've got no weapons. <laughs> what? What are you doing, buddy? Screw it, there's no one in here anyway. Right, ow! The door's shut in my face! <laughs> okay, we're going in, we're going in. Screw you, airlock. Whoa! Whoa, what the? Why does it do that? It's just opening and closing. <laughs> uh, nice smoke effects, though. What the hell? Okay. Oh, no! What the? Just... Are you kidding me? This yeah. airlock's trolling me, mate. Alright. <laughs> Opens the door. Huh? Wait! Are you in a tom hole? I'm the answer. Okay, it's doing the thing. Yeah, go, 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 go! Okay, I made it inside. What's this? It's a nothing. Um. Oh, there's a thing here. What's the thing do? Power cell accepted and active. Okay, so this is some kind of core. What's all this stuff? It's just stuff. Just cool looking stuff. Lag! What's going on? Is this the end <laughs> for Shogunate Tom? It looks that way. I think Ooh. I just crashed looking at a sh Oh, no, no. It just froze for an extended period. We're back. So we've got like energy fields instead of glass. Which is just, no just about noticeable. It's pretty cool. There's a lot of stuff in this which is like pretty cool. Um, what are you doing? Okay. What's this? Can we can we interact with anything? No. Okay. No. It just looks cool, I guess. Oh, can we like sleep here? If that would make sense, it would have some functionality. But no, I can't interact with anything. I'm guessing it's a shelter for those that are trapped on the planet. Yeah, it must be. Rescue. Right. Maybe they get storms. Okay, nice lighting on my cockpit. <laughs> my, Excuse me. My, no, <laughs> my cockpit is a different shade than the rest of the ship. Maybe it's because it's glass. I don't know. It just looks like there's no dust effects in between me and the cockpit, but the rest of the ship looks super realistic. I don't know, maybe it's just... No, it's not just me at all. The cockpit looks weird. All right, was this the only building here? Yeah, it was. So it's an airlock.
It's an airlock that's meant to trap you. So I ended up going to probably one of the most uninteresting places on the planet. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Mission complete. Quick game, uninstall it. <laughs> hey man, once we got over the hill, it actually, it, you know, it, it's, it's, it's just, dude, you've got to have a really high-end system and you got to be prepared to put up with a lot. Like, I've essentially done one thing, you know, like I've flown, I've flown to a place. That's all I've really yep. done. You could describe what's taken an hour, you know. And the joke is, you crashed a couple of times. Yeah, it crashed loads, mate, before we got here. Um, all right, so I guess I have to close. Flight ready. Engine on. It'd be nice if uh, this one was a self-destruct button or something. But it doesn't do anything. So, okay. You said I was going to run out of fuel, right? Yeah, mate. Okay, well, there it is, guys. Thanks for watching the stream. We're going to jump over to something else now. Next time I hit this will probably be to visit somewhere other than where I just went. Um, and the new update. And the new update, yeah, if there is, is one. Um, last thing I'm going to do is fly back to space and then we'll log out. Which you would think should be pretty straightforward, but nothing has been straightforward yet, so let's see. What's it saying? My maximum safe speed is going up, and then I'm going slightly faster. I'm at 6,000. Look at this! Your fuel is low. Yeah, cheers. All I did was fly to one place. So, I don't even know where my fuel gauge is. Should we see if we can find it? Is that fuel? It's not running no. down. It's not running down, so I guess it's not fuel. Is this fuel? That's heat. What's this? Ah. Ah. Let me, let me see it. Uh, I don't know. There's nothing labeled fuel. I don't think. I mean, I can't see anything that's like run out or anything like that. Is that fuel? Just says usage. No freaking idea, man. No idea, mate. And the HUD's all over the place. Right. So I think this is space now. I don't know. Let's find out. Looks like space to me. No HUD though. Yeah, if you're transitioning. Well, I would have thought this is space though, right? So there's more places. But they're clearly on the other side of the planet. All of them. Yep. Okay, well, you know, that's the end of that, guys. Thanks for watching. This is where I get Bye off the bus. Game.